New this morning, if the car of the future is here today, you are going to find it in Russellville. A group of Arkansas Tech students built a car that gets nearly a thousand miles per gallon. THV 11's David Lippman shows us how they did it and what their achievement could mean for the university. If you wanted to take a trip from Arkansas Tech to Bourbon Street or the Grand Ole Opry or maybe even the Magnolia Market in Waco, you could do that on one gallon of gas with the car these Arkansas Tech students built. I was shocked when he said 993. I was like, say that one more time. <laughs> 993 miles per gallon. That's what the team achieved when they entered their prototype gas powered car in the Shell Eco Marathon competition in California last weekend. I mean, I was kind of hoping for 500 just to not get my hopes up too much. Last year, we only got 212. Last year, the team used a car that a previous group left unfinished. This time, they built a new model from scratch. This was uh, built, not bought. All the students here, just the eight of us, and a very small amount of money put this car together. Good job. Good job. With only $2,000, they finished third among all American teams in their division, beating teams that spent substantially more money. What's great about working with this team is that if I didn't know how to do something or another guy didn't know how to do something, there was someone else that was able to do it. So that, that was fantastic. It's going to be very hard to recruit uh, students that are just as enthusiastic and motivated to come in countless hours each night working on something like this. Braden Butler said driving the car was like driving a coffin with a window. You won't see something like this on the road soon but their work could be the future of transportation. There's tweaks that we've made, but I mean, a lot of these can be, can be you know, carried over to vehicles, you know, making it lightweight, uh, more aerodynamic, those kind of things are, you know, somewhat um, easy to, to, you know, to bring over to the car world. All but one of the students will graduate this spring, but they have a drive to make next year's team even better. We can take uh, donations, we can take sponsorships. Uh, I think if we take more money and more support going into future years will definitely be a top team in the world. The ATU Society of Automotive Engineers, to which these students all belong, will host a big car show on April 20th. It's a Saturday. It's the group's biggest fundraiser of the year, and all the proceeds will go toward next year's project. Reporting in Russellville, David Littman for THV 11 News.